Title, A Literary Analysis of Reset for Parents, How to Keep Your Kids from Backsliding, by Todd Friel. In Reset for Parents, How to Keep Your Kids from Backsliding, Todd Friel addresses a pressing concern for parents in today's ever-changing world. With the rapid expansion of technology and the influx of diverse influences, parents are increasingly challenged to ensure that their children maintain their values and faith. Friel's book serves as a guide for parents seeking to navigate this complex terrain and offers valuable insights into the art of nurturing faith and character in their children. Friel starts by acknowledging the prevalent anxiety among parents concerning the secular forces that often tug at their children. He describes the challenges parents face in contemporary society, where traditional values may be undermined by various influences, both online and offline. He proposes that a reset is necessary to counteract these influences and create an environment where faith can flourish. One of the strengths of Friel's book is his relatable writing style. He employs a conversational tone throughout the book, making it accessible to a wide audience. This approach ensures that parents can engage with the content, even if they are not well-versed in theology or child-rearing theories. The book's accessibility and its practical advice contribute to its effectiveness as a guide for parents. Friel highlights the importance of consistent communication and modeling of faith. He argues that parents must not only teach but also embody the values and beliefs they wish to instill in their children. His emphasis on modeling aligns with the theory of social learning, where children tend to mimic the behavior and values of their parents. Friel encourages parents to evaluate their own faith and values and consider how they can model these for their children. Furthermore, Friel underlines the significance of engaging in open and honest conversations with children. He encourages parents to create an environment where children feel safe to ask questions and express their doubts. This approach aligns with developmental psychology, which suggests that healthy cognitive development occurs when children are encouraged to explore and question. By fostering open dialogue, parents can address their children's concerns and guide them toward a stronger faith. Friel also discusses the importance of setting boundaries. He contends that parents should establish clear guidelines regarding the consumption of media and exposure to external influences. By doing so, parents can protect their children from harmful content and encourage the development of discernment. Friel draws from principles of behaviorism, which highlight the significance of environmental factors in shaping behavior. By controlling the child's environment, parents can positively influence their development. One of the central themes in Reset for Parents is the concept of spiritual discipleship. Friel argues that parents must actively disciple their children, which involves nurturing their spiritual growth and understanding. He advocates for the use of resources such as devotionals, Bible study, and prayer as tools for fostering faith in children. This approach is rooted in religious education theories, emphasizing the importance of religious instruction for faith development. Friel's book also addresses the role of the church in reinforcing the values and faith of children. He asserts that parents should involve their children in church activities and youth groups to provide a supportive community and further reinforce their faith. This notion aligns with the socio-ecological model, which suggests that individuals are influenced by various interconnected systems, including family and community. Involvement in a faith community can provide children with a strong sense of belonging and purpose. While Reset for Parents offers valuable insights and practical advice, it is not without its limitations. Friel's book primarily focuses on a specific religious perspective, which may limit its applicability to parents from diverse faith backgrounds. Moreover, the book does not delve deeply into the challenges that may arise when attempting to balance traditional religious teachings with the evolving cultural landscape. 
In conclusion, Todd Friel's Reset for Parents, How to Keep Your Kids from Backsliding, is a valuable resource for parents seeking guidance in nurturing their children's faith and values. Friel's accessible writing style, emphasis on modeling and open communication, and his focus on spiritual discipleship make the book a practical and relatable guide. While it may not address the needs of all parents, it provides a useful framework for those looking to instill faith and character in their children in a rapidly changing world.